Hi guys, this is Martin, aka Martin the Vlogger, and this channel is everything about riding, fun, and petrol headwood. And today, today it is also about a few items from La Monster Garage, and more precisely about these super cool floorboards that we will be putting on this not pink, but Salmon uh, Riker 900 that BRP Center Slovakia gave me for a couple of days while my Dug Beast is actually at the doctor for its yearly check. And you know, all of these items, maybe you know that I'm running the largest European shop for Kenem Spider and Riker aftermarket parts. Of course, I'm working with La Monster Garage and I have chosen a couple of items that from my experience as a spider rider, in order to improve stability, in, in order to improve safety, handling, um, performance, comfort, I would be putting on the Riker if I would own one. And these are only a couple of items and today we will focus, as I said, on the floorboards. Guys, uh, I think this is enough of this. We will do installation and I'll show you how they look because these stock ones, these food packs are just absolutely tiny and terrible. So let's get started. Now as for the installation, uh, the job is very, very simple. Uh, probably as simple as to put those wheel nuts we did in the episode before. So uh, basically you will get these two floorboard holders and you will need to remove the stock uh, pack basically. Uh, replace them with one of these. Uh, this one with with the hook or whatever it, this pin is, it's going on a on a brake side uh, of the bike. Uh, I will do just one side because I'm short on time. But the only difference is that the floorboard will work with the highest position uh, of the of the brake. So don't don't forget about that. And now let me remove this uh, foot pack and put this uh, holder there. Of course, it's still possible to, to move uh, the position, so everything is in there. Oh yeah. What do you think? <laughs> I think they are really nice and they fit the bike. I think even better than just like this. I don't know, you tell me. I mean, if you know me, like I'm gonna be the last one telling you that floorboards looks better on the bike than the bike without the floorboards, but somehow this, this one just fits there. They're not big, they're not small, so they're gonna be definitely comfortable. And by the way, the quality it's really thick and it's 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 a proper quality it's really a proper quality and they're anti-slippery and they just look beautiful i'm gonna test them what you want me to say um they're really comfortable i mean comparing to this uh it's just it's just a different ball game and uh now, there is one trouble. Uh, I'm gonna do a review about many things from La Monster. And uh, one of those things will be floorboards, mini floorboards. So it's almost like same size, I think, like this for my F3. And my worry is gonna be like, <laughs> hopefully I will not like them. So I will not keep them on the Beast because Beast is everything about style. But here, like this is not a sales pitch. This is not me trying to sell it to you, but I think they look absolutely, you know, they fit the bike. All right, enough about floorboards. Uh, next episode, I will talk about mirrors because I cannot see a thing in those mirrors, especially in the city. Uh, guys, in case you like what I do, subscribe to my channel, have the notifications on, visit martinthevlogger.com slash shop, the largest European shop for Canem Spider and Riker aftermarket parts. And remember, upgrade the bike the way that you like and always have fun.